I'm down in the Grave area with uh, Olivia Bernard from uh, Domaine de Chevalier. We're going to do a, just a magnificent tasting today. Um, for those of you who have not tasted his wines, his reds are absolutely, they're outstanding. He took over the estate in 1983. He's almost been here for 30 years. And it just seems like, especially in the last 10 or 15 years, you've, you've produced just some unbelievable, outstanding um, Bordeaux-style red, red wines here. And your white wines are equally as good. And we have to start with uh, vintage like, uh, like 62. Okay, well here we go. 1962, a wine that is nearly 50 years old. Well, uh, only. Only, only, just a young child. Just yeah. a young... <laughs> <laughs> that there is, uh... Well, you, you should take, if you're watching this, you should take some lessons on this. If you happen to have some very old wines, mm. um, opening them up can take some sensitivity and some skill and uh, some elegance, I guess we should say now. <laughs> yes, but sometimes you can uh, broke the core. Yes. It's not easy. And sometimes you was just to do that like that. <laughs> <laughs> So, you know, I wouldn't, I, wouldn't have had the I wouldn't have had the courage and to do that. I was asking you earlier, what, do, you, do you have a history of what the growing season was like in uh, 1962? So, 62 was, yeah. um, was a good vintage. Um, we had some uh, uh, water in August, so there was a little bit of dilution on the vintage, but the maturity was quite good. And uh, the vintage was uh, uh, very... Uh, good, especially for white, uh, but uh, there was some lovely red. Well, it's interesting. Uh, this, this 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 is starting to have that aged look to it. It's yeah, just uh, you can yeah. see the color is turning. Yes, um, it has that sort of. Uh, but it's very brilliant in the same time. Yeah, it yeah. is. So that means when the color is is as a little bit of as a little evolution like this one, but it's still very brilliant. That means that the wine is still very good. When the color is brown and the color is uh, is not bring this uh, trouble. Yeah, that means that the wine is. Uh, going yeah, you on. can just see the, the very beginning of a little bit of garnet, just a little bit, just sort of weaved yes. in there, but it's there. Yes, but this wine uh, really don't to be drunk with food. You know, it, it's not wine for tasting like that. It's really a wine for. We'll have it. The rest of the bottle will be drunk for dinner. <laughs> I promise you. There you are. I, I'm sure you're right about that. <laughs> And again, it's not a it's not a big wine, especially after fifty years. But there is a, a lovely uh, complexity, a lovely expression, and the, the from the beginning up to the end, you have uh, uh, this expression is very complex. It's not the same one from the beginning at the end. There is a very complex thing. So your mouth go a different way. And I like this uh, surprise. This this is just aging beautifully. It's, it's just beautiful. just beautiful. You know, it's it. The fruit is is still uh, it has personality to it, but you can tell it's becoming mature fruit. It's sort of like I think I described it. it almost, it's almost like a dark raspberry in mm -hmm. this that, that, that I sense. It's, it's also here. the coffee also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This co co the, the yeah, the torrefaction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, 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 this coffee in there. Um, the, may, you know. Maybe cacao. I was going to say, you make kind of a mocha. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And, and I'm almost wondering if there's like a, a little bit of prune. I mean, there, there, mm -hmm. there, there, are, seasoned, there are seasoned fruits in here, fruits mm -hmm. that, that, that um, have rich, uh, maybe fig, maybe prune, but yes. it, it's... Um, but not too much. But no, just, just, just a little hint. It, it's un it's yes. underneath. Yes. Yes. And, and actually, the wonderful thing about a wine like this as it ages is really everything is underneath and it weaves together like 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 a, like a silk carpet, and the, each little, little strand is the another wine. The wine reveal a, a lot of different things, but you have to go there. You know, this is just this is a magnificent wine, and this is uh, this is just aging beautifully. What, what is funny, you know, in a, in a big wine, the wine can give you a big expression, but very often behind is short. Here, this wine is very complex. But I drink it for two or three minutes, the wine is still here. Yeah, it is. It is. Yes, it's lovely, long aftertaste. But it's a soft, but it's a soft it's, aftertaste. It's it not a big, it's not big. Um, it, it just, it lingers very softly. So just, just 
What a great effort. Beautiful, beautiful wine. 